guys. Going into that fourth quarter, um, you're down pretty big. What's your mindset that kind of led you to having that late comeback that fell just a little bit short? Well, I mean, up to that point, um, we didn't play well at all. Um, but we knew we had one more quarter to give everything we had, and um, that's what we did. Um, we we never give up. Um, so we we just left everything else we had um, out on the floor, and it's frustrating because uh, I think we could have done that earlier. So that energy, that fight. So. Alexa, particularly inside. I mean, Monica was kind of controlling the game for you know a lot of a lot of the day. And I guess, I guess what changed in the fourth quarter that allowed you guys to start getting a little more push inside? Well, she's a really good player. You know, there's no everybody everything everybody knows that in the Big Ten and even NCAA in general that she's a good player. But obviously, at first, I feel like we kind of settled for jump shots and didn't really attack to the basket and once we started doing that you know she picked up a foul here and there and um, by the end of the game like she could she couldn't be as aggressive plus we kind of figured out not figured out we didn't figure out because obviously we lost but uh, by the end of the game we kind of understood of how to guard maybe better you know, our coach box was, um, we were trying different stuff. I mean, yeah. And uh, <clears throat> I, I feel like her foul trouble would probably, and us being aggressive, kind of paid off, you know, a little. <laughs> Alexa, I noticed you went through senior day. Grace didn't. You both are in the same spot. Does that speak to anything with your decision, or was it? or why you went through senior day and she did. I don't want you to speak for Grace, but I want you to speak for yourself with your decision on why you went through senior day and she didn't. Um, well, uh, as of now, uh, my decision is that I will continue playing basketball in Europe. And uh, yeah, I will not use my COVID year. What do you feel like um, the team could have did differently tonight so far as overall performance? Uh, well, from the beginning, uh, we didn't have energy. Uh, we didn't have to fight. Uh, defensively, I don't know if we executed any of the game plan. Um, and so that's really frustrating because uh, we had we had the game plan and we didn't go out and do it. Um, and you saw the result of that. Um, yeah. Now that you've seen what Iowa has to offer this season, how eager are you to get to Iowa City and hopefully play a redemption game? Uh, very, <laughs> yeah. All right, All right. yeah. And we'll be ready. Allie, this isn't the first time you've gone through senior day. How did this one <laughs> feel different than, than the past? Um, uh, you got it. Yeah, I mean, obviously this is, you know, We know we know how how Ali is and how much she loves Indiana and uh, obviously like playing being here being a Hoosier for such a long time <clears throat> is you know we're her family Hoosier Nation is her family and uh, you know being so close and familiar with the coaching coaching staff of course it's hard and I feel like you know it's <laughs> rough you can see <laughs> you can see in her face yeah. I love playing here, um, so it's tough, and to lose is even tougher. Um, but you know we're not done at all. So, um, however many games you know I have left as Hoosier, I'm I'm gonna give it my all um, because I do love love IU and I love my teammates and my coaches. So, yeah.